Hello everybody, welcome back and welcome to another vlog. Today is February 15th, yesterday was Valentine's Day and I just had a really 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 chill day and I went over to my parents and my mom made the TikTok pasta. I'll overlay some of the footage I took yesterday but it was delicious. I'm not someone who likes tomatoes but that recipe is bomb you guys. I think it's definitely going to make it in some of my recipes I make often because it was really really easy and so so delicious. And because of Valentine's Day my stepdad brought me these beautiful flowers made me cry. He brought them a few days before Valentine's Day when I was really really grumpy. I was having a shit day and then he called me. He was like hey can you open the front door? And I was like, what? Why? And then he ran up to my door in the freezing cold and gave me these flowers and that balloon you see in the background. So cute. Turned my day around, made me cry. It was too, too cute. But yeah, I didn't vlog last week because it was way too cold and I was just kind of grumpy or I was just catching up on work. So basically I sat on my couch the whole time and when I wasn't on my couch, I was in bed. So that would have been the most boring vlog ever. But this week is looking up and there's more fun things happening this week. So, so I do have to film something this morning. So I'm going to head to my office, which is such a far trek. Pit stop. One thing that did arrive last week was a new piece of furniture. I got this ginormous ottoman for my couch which takes up pretty much my entire bonus room here but it makes my couch 10 times cozier and this is exactly what I wanted it's just basically a giant bed now and it's the coziest thing my couch is from West Elm same with Ottoman I believe it's called the Haven couch this is what the living room is looking like so far I freaking love it I actually do have to refilm a video because sadly my microphone wasn't plugged in all the way so I lost all of that footage and it was a shot my stash so I'm gonna refilm that. That video will definitely be up by the time this goes live. This is the lineup of products I chose and a lot of you are wondering what my lighting setup is and I film with natural lighting from this window I have and a ring light. So I'm going to take some time and film that then I'm going to send the footage off to my editor Emma so I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. I just finished filming. Here is the final look. I'm currently uploading all of the files to my Google Drive to send off to Emma and I think it was a blessing in disguise that my first video failed because my energy in today's video was way better so that's a great feeling. But anyways, now I'm going to head downstairs because I want a snack. And my parents found something yesterday at Costco that I've been wanting for months, but it's been sold out all the time. I'm just going to head downstairs and actually show you instead of just sitting here. It's the Ninja Foodie. <laughs> they found one. This has been sold out for so long. I swear this is like gold. So basically it's like an instant pot as well as a air fryer in one machine and I'm so excited to have one. It's just going to make making food so much quicker, which is a dream because I do not like cooking that much to be honest. So I'm going to find something I can quickly put in here to test it out for the first time, but I need to unbox it first. So I don't have that many snacky things to crisp up, but I only have these, so I'm down for a second breakfast. Um, I'm gonna throw in like two of these. And crisp, 3.90 for 12 minutes. Actually, many of you were asking what my diet is since I showed a lot of vegetarian foods last week and I don't think I have a label. I'd say I eat mostly vegetarian. I cook pretty much just vegetarian foods in my house. I'll sometimes eat chicken nuggets and I also eat salmon and tuna if I'm having sushi. I feel like I eat those things at least once or twice a month. Other than that, all vegetarian. I don't really have a label because whenever I do put a label on things, I feel like I'll crave whatever is out of that label, if that makes any sense. So I just eat what my body feels like eating. So now you know. But now let's wait for these things to crisp up. I'm so excited. Okay, it just beeped saying it's done. Let's see. Oh my God. 
They turned out so much better than when I pan fry them. Incredible. So I just put a little bit of mayo and this stuff, which you guys need to try if you love hot sauces and that kind of stuff. This is incredible. Here it is. It's so good. Sometimes I cook just so I can use this. Okay, let's have a little try. Mm-hmm. This tastes way better. That gets my stamp of approval for sure. And I'm also having a little kombucha. So it's been a little bit since you last saw me. I've just been chilling on my couch and I've been organizing my week. I'm thinking of making two dinners that I can just have on hand. I think I'm going to make a soup and I'm going to also roast a bunch of veggies so I can make Buddha bowls because that's what I've been craving this week. Okay, so for my soup, I have some onion in here and I just have been softening them up a little bit. And now I'm going to add my celery and carrot. I have like one and a half carrot and three celery sticks. And now I'm going to add some cauliflower and some broccoli. Now I'm going to be adding seven cups of water. This is just like a veggie soup. Uh, and then I'm going to add some lentils. These are green ones that I already had cooked. I'm going to throw in this cashew sauce. I just um, have blended up cashews with a little bit of nutritional yeast. And it just adds like a creamy factor. Then I'm going to be adding some basil. I'm just going to add in a healthy amount, a lot, I like a lot. I'm just gonna add a huge handful of spinach. This is gonna be a huge soup, oh my god, I need a lot. I'm gonna have to freeze some, but super healthy, feels good, and it actually tastes incredible. I love blended soups. And these are the veggies I'm going to throw in here to try. And I have some Brussels sprouts, broccoli, and cauliflower. <laughs> Roast. I'm gonna go 400 for. Let's try 15. I'm gonna see 10 first and I'll check every couple of minutes. And I also blanched some kale. Oh my god, that's so much soup! Oh lord. Look, guys, I have like four minutes left and it's already. Pretty roasted. <laughs> That's insane. Okay, so I put some quinoa in my bowl. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this sauce, kind of layer it. Okay, that was more than I wanted, but that's okay. I'm gonna take a little bit of kale, and then I'm going to layer, oh, why did I grab it with my hands? And I'm going to put some vegetables on top. And there we go. I'm going to pop on an episode of Peaky Blinders and enjoy this, and then I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Birmingham or something. Smoke brings it back. Where's John? Do you think so? So I moved over to the bedroom. I've just been watching some YouTube videos and my mom FaceTimed me and I was like, what the heck? It's so late. It's literally 11.30 at night. And she told me my stepsister has gone into labor. I'm so excited I'm going to have another niece. <laughs> it's crazy. Molly's going to be a big sister. I'm so, so, so excited. And I'm so, so proud of you, Jess and Jared. And I'm so over the moon excited. I don't know how I'm going to sleep tonight, but I definitely need to try. So I think I'm going to call it a night and I'll see you guys in the morning. Hello everyone. Happy Tuesday. I'm starting it off in my office today because I need to get a move on. It's 1 p.m. and still no baby yet, but Jared just texted the group chat saying that she just started to push, so it should be any time now, which is crazy. This morning I was just gathering my stuff to do my taxes, which is not very fun. I just whipped up a little quick lunch slash breakfast. I did like a scramble. I put like spinach, red peppers, orange peppers, green peppers, mushrooms, a little bit of onion, and some cheese. It's pretty good. It's been my go-to breakfast. The amount of vegetables I've had in the last <laughs> 24 hours is insane. It's not always like this, you guys. So I'm going to eat this, and then I have to film an IGTV for a brand. I'm doing like a little IGTV or reels, so keep tuned for that. It's a really exciting partnership for me. I'll talk a little bit more about it 
uh, later on today because I need to, I need to do it. I'm an auntie again. <laughs> I'm so excited. She was born at 1248 and she is seven pounds, five ounces and no name yet. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited and so proud. Oh, okay. I'm going to go call my mom. <laughs> Uh, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. So I just had to stop filming my IGTV just because the products weren't performing to my standards. So that's sadly a contract that I'm going to have to dip out of, but that's totally okay. You win some and you lose some. I'm just feeling a little disappointed because I was really excited for this partnership. It was kind of a full circle moment for me, but this new launch just wasn't there. I'll talk a little bit more about it in an actual review, but it's okay. My makeup does look really great. Most of the products are from the original lineup. It was just mostly like for the eye products and I took off the lip already, but these were the deepest colors that they had out of the collection and I don't find them to be very inclusive. I had to build up this dark brown color like six times to get it where it's at on my eyes right now, which isn't the best and not a great quality product, but that's too bad. I just, I cannot promote stuff like that because I would not be able to go to bed knowing that you guys are spending your money on that kind of stuff when I know I don't love the product fully. But now I'm kind of unsure what to do with my afternoon here because I did block it off to edit that. Hello everyone, I'm currently sitting on my floor so I can get some good light from my lamp. <laughs> I've been editing up this vlog as well as a few other things. Then I FaceTimed my mom for a little bit and while I was doing that I had some of my soup I made yesterday. But now I don't know why but I'm like freezing cold so I think tonight is the perfect night to have a bath and I just want it to be a vibe in there. So I think I'm going to put this in my bathroom too. This is my skylight. This is the one that makes my ceiling look all cool with the green laser beams and like the blue twirly lights. I've done this once before, but I think I want to do it again because it was a vibe. I'm placing it far away from where I'll be. <laughs>
Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday. I do have some news. They decided to name her Evelyn Mark Taylor, which I love. It's such a cute name. Mark is my stepdad's middle name, which is so sweet. I really hope I get to meet and squeeze her little cute cheeks soon. Today is such a beautiful blue sky day. I'm so, so happy. And it's actually a lot warmer than it's been for the last couple weeks. It's minus 13, which is still still cold but not minus 30 or 40 cold anymore which i'm grateful for today i am going to be filming a video for sure and then i might go for a walk or something just because i haven't been able to go for a walk in a very long time it's been very painful every time i've tried the last couple of weeks it's just been way too cold and i need to get out of these four walls for sure Faster. <laughs> yeah, I'm not very athletic. <laughs> what? <laughs> nice. See, you're athletic. Look at these cute cute stickers Jamie Page sent me. I feel so spoiled. I love them so much. They have insane quality. They're beautiful. Look at that little matcha one. I think these three packs are my favorites. This one's so cozy and inviting. I love the Valentine's Day aesthetic. And these plant ones, look how happy they are. So cute. Thank you, Jamie. These are beautiful. I think I'm going to decorate my laptop with them. I have like a weird thing with stickers. Sometimes I have commitment issues, but I'm going to stick them on my laptop so I can look at them every single day and appreciate them. and it went really really well it was pretty interesting to listen but I didn't end up filming the video I wanted today just because I've been a little bit off today today is the third anniversary of my friend's disappearance his name was Ryan and I don't know it's just a weird day but thankfully my brother came over and we went for a really fun walk and we, we went to the park as you would have seen already that definitely cheered me up yeah it's just a little bit of a weird sad day it's like a weird day that i don't really know how to manage my feelings and he's been definitely on my heart this week i've been thinking about him like crazy and i didn't even realize that the anniversary was this week already i've just been looking at older pictures of us revisiting the memories i've had my little trip to vegas and my parents were really close with his parents and they'd come over for dinners often and we'd play Wii all the time especially Just Dance because that is just the funniest game to play with family and friends and I remember I had the biggest crush on him and I remember back in the day I was quite a bit younger but I was like if I kill this dance he's going to be so impressed and he'll, he'll no doubt want to be my girlfriend. <laughs> so those are funny memories. So today's been a little bit heavier. I might just call it a night here just so I can really chill out, hang out with my brother. I might go for a drive or something, but I truly feel like I just need to take it easy tonight. I have hurt feelings. So I hope you guys have a good night or whatever time you're watching this and I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow morning. 
Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. We're just in the Starbucks drive through I'm with my mama. <laughs> and we just finished an appointment at the bank. Okay, hold on. We're going to be ordering here. What do you want? Oh, I want the honey oat latte. Can I get a grande honey oat latte? I'll have a Beyond Meat breakfast sandwich, please. For sure. With that, I'll just have a grande half decaf Americano, please. You got it. Can you make it two of the Beyond Meat sandwiches, please? Yeah, of course. They're so okay. good. Uh, we just finished an appointment at the bank. Um, I feel like a real adult right now. And I also have just makeup here on up. I just bronzed my forehead just because I knew I was going to be wearing a mask today. <laughs> And I do the bare minimum, honestly. Um, <laughs> and now we're off to go to our house for my grandma. Uh, and I wanted to take you guys along. Hopefully she'll like this place. That'd be awesome because I would love for her to move closer to all of us for so many reasons. Yeah, so I wanted to bring you guys along. It should be a fun time. Yes. If the price adjustment... Um Okay, so we came in here. Yes. Yeah, Hi, Dan. You guys are super high. Yeah, it's like fun. with paint and like the two big, big yeah. windows. It is so cozy. Yeah, flooring, paints, all of it. Oh, oh, what did you do? Oh, this is big. That's Holy. how toilets you see. <laughs> So we just finished at the house not too long ago. What did you think about Matthew? It was dope. Also, I'm not quite sure how much I'll include of the house tour just because they did really like it and I know people can find the listing, but if they decide to get it, I'll definitely do a walkthrough tour and a plan for all the renovations because it definitely needs some updating and it's not completely my grandma style. And this kid might move in there too with her. But now we're out on a nice walk. He had to borrow one of my coats <laughs> because he <laughs> forgot his phone. I want to be synced with your footsteps. Oh! What? I think I messed up a little bit. You're supposed, supposed to keep, keep walking, walking, not just stop. <laughs> So we just got back from our little walk and I came home to a couple packages. I got the new Benefit Mascara. It has magnetic technology in it, so I'm intrigued to try that. And it has a little interactive PR package. There's this little magnet. So here is the mascara. It has a little magnet at the top. Here's the wand. We'll give that a go. Alongside that, they sent a stapler. <laughs> Also this magnet sheet, which I think is really funny because it's like this little dial. It says, today I feel, I don't know, this bitey lip or I feel eyeball, but I have an idea. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. I love when brands send home decor. <laughs> I actually really like it. And then the other package is from Bare Minerals and it's so cute. Oh, it's a cute little suitcase. This is for a Zoom event happening soon. They just sent over some new things that they have launched and they also partnered with Hailey Bieber and I think she's going to be a part of that Zoom, which is crazy. And they also partnered with Levi's, which is cool for the event. Um, so they sent over some little patches to put on a jean jacket or something. This one's my favorite, a little neutral heart. And then in this box here, it has all of the new products. I'm not sure if they've launched right now, so I won't show them. Thank you so much, Bare Minerals. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm a mess. So now me and my brother are going to order in some food <laughs> and we're gonna watch WandaVision, which I really recommend you guys watching it's so good hello again so the plans have changed a little bit i didn't end up ordering in food i decided i wanted to wait on that a little bit and i wasn't feeling good about myself so i decided to have a shower but look what i snatched from my parents house this week i found the wii <laughs> and the only game i could find was the super mario bros game which i'm not complaining that's the one i wanted to play anyways so I'm just going to attempt to play this and this poor thing is so outdated I had to order this little converter. I'm really really excited to play Mario. The vibes. Oh! <laughs> I forgot which button was 
Let's jump. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> I need some practice. A little rough start, but not too bad. But I think I'm going to be doing this for a little bit because this is just too fun. So I've been playing Wario for the last hour and a half-ish and I started to get really, really frustrated. I was stuck at this one point of a level and out of frustration, I shut off the whole console, which I lost all my progress. That was not the vibe. But earlier today, my grandma, we call her Mei Mei, gave my brother and I each $20 to put towards dinner tonight, which is the freaking cutest thing ever. And I've decided I want to get a pizza. I feel like that'll be the perfect cap to this week. That sounds divine. But I think I'm going to end this week's vlog here. I decided I want to start attempting to take weekends off just to really reset and recharge. I feel like that would be really beneficial for me. <laughs> but I really hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much for watching. Let me know what you'd like to see in next week's vlog or if you want to see more of anything or whatever it may be, that would be super, super helpful. But I love you guys so very much and I will see you very soon. Bye.